we're going to put a floss tie on the second premolar is to put the floss through the mesial like so pull it through to make sure there's a level of mobility and then we're going to take the floss through the distal and we're going to pull that through and then we're going to cross the floss over. Can you see on the palatal here, if I just rotate it around palatally a little bit, you can see it's not fully down over the convexity. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to move it from side to side. You can see it pull down into the rubber dam there. And then I'm going to make a couple of little movements. I'm just going to cross over here. One, two, so we're over twice, and then we tighten between two hands here, and I'm going with two fingers, and I'm tightening that right down there, like so. And then I'm just gonna make one turn. Do you see what I did there? I went back, over, and under like so, pull that through, and then I'm going down and I'm pulling with this hand and I'm pushing with this hand. So pull, push. So that goes right down nice and tight. And then we're holding that so that both lengths are tight. And you can do one of two things here. Some people choose to tie that to the frame. And that can be quite useful if you want to retract the rubber dam out of the way. I would clip off about that, leaving about that length. So that's the floss tie.